Welcome back to Okami. I am Jimmy Joe. Um, back again with Okami. I think I just said that. Oh well. Um, trying to figure out how to get to up there. Oh, there's a thingy here. Um, I just got a Steam controller, so I'm trying to figure out the camera a little bit. Doesn't work too well with the Steam controller, but. Uh, camera, camera, come on. Alright, there we go. But, we'll figure it out. I don't remember what we were actually supposed to be doing, but I know we were supposed to go here. Oh, uh, looks like we're gonna have to lightning this thing. It has to be here for ages, but nobody knows what it's here, what it's for. There are many things like that in Nippon. No one knows when they were built or even who built them. I suppose people have more important things to think about. Oop, wrong button. Oop, wrong button. There we go, this button. Obtain the crystal! Hooray! Alright. I need to... Whoops. Oh. Uh, come on, camera! Ah, wrong button! There we go. Uh, camera. There we go. Got it. Now, what is this going to do for us? All right. So we have to go in here. You know this where this hole leads to? You know, there was a foul smoke rising from Nine Tails which flew off to the northern lands. That's what's waiting for us on the other side of this tunnel. Anyway, what's up with that creepy lightning? I'm getting a bad feeling about this. How do you know that this is where the tunnel goes? What's through the tunnel? What's through the tunnel? Da, 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 da. There's nothing in here, so we're gonna go outside. Come away! Burr! It's cold out here. Is it cold out here or what? How can anywhere be so darn cold? I know Kamui Kamu is the northernmost part of Nippon, but come on. Wow, we traveled really far in a short amount of time. I don't remember it ever snowing this hard before. Listen, Amy, I'm going to hunker down your, this fur coat of yours. You try to find us some shelter from this nasty blizzard. Wow, alright. What's this way? Oh, let's see. It's a save point, and I am recording. Gotta remember to check that every once in a while. <coughs> where, where am I? There we go. There's a shovel here. Can I... No? Nothing? Alright. Maybe I can hit on this. Okay, I guess we're gonna do a cutscene then. Oh. 
Alright. Is it just me or did some of those uh some of these are very thick lines and I don't know what oh I didn't realize I could do thick lines. Must use extra, um, must use extra ink or something. guys were easy. Where did I end up? Uh... Okay, so there's nothing really here. I'm s suspecting that I cannot go this way. This is crazy, Amy! Blizzard's going to freeze us in our tracks. Let's pull back for now. Alright. Suspicion confirmed. What was this? Nope, I can't get anything from that. Um. Let's see what's in here then. Burr! Look! Fire! Fire! Guess we're not gonna freeze to death after all. Huh? What's this? Ooh. Funky mask. Actually, without the mask, I think that's Waka. What's your problem, Mammy? I'm allowed to relax in front of the fire, ain't I? Yikes! You? Um. Um. It could be uh, what's his face from the the village. I can't remember his name, but the. Yeah, what's the, what is his name? You see that, Amy? I'm not talking about that silly mask. I mean his sword. That puppy's a bona fide masterpiece. Well, I suppose we ought to. Oh, what's this? Salmon. This is a tree used for practicing sword strokes. Looks like it's seen a lot of use. Yeah, it's um. Ah, oh, why can't I remember his name? This is the scaredy dude. Looks like he means business. Let's fight. Okay. I have a feeling we're going to have to talk to him afterwards, but... Ooh. Guess we're going to have to just use swords. No fire, no fire, no fire, no fire, no fire, no fire. Ow! Froze me. Ow! Ow!
No! Oh, come on! Ow! 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 Where are my big bones? I thought I had big bones. Oh, that, that works. No! Oh, those things suck. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, they hurt so much. Oh. Die! Come on! Oh! Oh! So close! What? It's not over? That's pretty cool. But it's not over! Ow. Can I... He doesn't actually take damage from it. Oh! Ouch. Ouch. This is almost like the shadow fight in, uh, Legend of Zelda in the Water Temple. Seems to be a lot of skirmishing. Ow. Oh, black, yes. What? No, not fair. Holy crap, holy crap. So I can kill these. They just take a little bit more damage. Or take a little less damage than what I'm used to. No! No! Ow.
Oh, stop it. Ugh, I don't need your... Okay, there's that. At least that one heals. Like those, those, uh, those clones give you health. All right, so close. Ow. Dang it! I can't tell when he's actually blocking. Got him. Oh. But that's really cool. He's probably the other uh, breaststroke god thing or whatever. Not bad, White One. I am Oki, warrior of the Ona tribe. Ona warrior Oki. You are ob obviously not our tribe. And I can see that you are no mere wolf either. What name do you go by? This here is Amaterasu, the great savior of Nippon. But, enough about that. Why do you have to attack us? <coughs> and why are you doing that with that sword in the first place? Oh, I see you have a punkle with you. Wait, is that his soon? I haven't seen you around in ages. Must be nice to be able to roam Nippon on the back of a wolf, huh? I heard you got tired of painting, and ran from this land in disgust about a year ago. So, why did you come back? Did you have some second thoughts? Why you? I don't know who you, are, who you two think you are, but you are nothing like the legendary Shiran Yui and the pint-sized warrior. Bah! Put a cork in it, will ya? Why don't you start by telling us why you have that sword? This sword? I have this sword because the time to wield it has come. What? As you well know, Kam <laughs> Kamui is a harsh land covered in snow and ice, and the monsters that infest the region only make our life worse. Yet we, the Ona tribe, have managed to survive to this day. It is because of the sacred Ezofuji Mountains have because the sacred Ezofuji Mountains have watched over us. However, our mothers and protectors, our most sacred of mountains, have been taken over by those demons. Yes, I speak of the twin demons. Le Lechu Lechku and Nechku. They have been imprisoned at the s twin summits of Ezofuji, but they suddenly broke free one day and began their deadly assault upon the land of Kamui. The snowstorms grew more intense, transforming Kamanui, Kama Kamui into a frozen wasteland. Those demons are back? Many of our tribe have been killed by, the recent, by their relentless attacks. It was as if they roamed our land in search of something. But they mercilessly slaughter all of the Oinya... Oinya? Is it Ona? No, it's Oinya. <laughs> all the Oinya 
they come across. The good earth is losing its power and its soul. Without these gifts of the gods, Kamui will become uninhabitable. I must slay those wretched demons now before it's too late. What about the villagers? They should be battling the cold that blasts down from Ezofuji. After all, our village lies at their base. It is only a matter of time before Kamui becomes an icy tomb. An icy tomb? What are you doing out here with that guardian sword? Why did you bring it out of the village? Did I not say the time to use the sword has come? You have heard of the prophecy of, this, of salvation, have you not? The wall of ice shall shatter and open the way to the heavens. When Kutone, the guardian sword, glows silver, it means that when this sword glows silver, riding, ridding the village of its abominable blizzard will be a child's play. The sword's gonna start glowing. Yes, but Kutone will not wake until it has tasted more monster blood. So I will continue slaying the foul beasts wherever they may be. Until Kutone lights our way to victory. All right. All right. What else you got to say? It appears the blizzard has lightened a bit. I know not what the, when the demons will launch another terrible blizzard, but now would be your best chance to flee to the village. Wait a second, Oki. I can't believe the chief let you take the sword. I mean, he tanned my hide once for even touching the darn thing. I already told you, the time to wield it has come. The wall of ice shall shatter and open the way to the heavens. When Katone, the guardian sword, glows silver, it means that when the sword glows silver, ridding the village of his abominable blizzard will be child's play. But Katone will never... Yeah, we already saw this. Why are they making us listen to it again? Cool. Alright, looks like more cursed zone... So there's only one way I can go. Hello, Mr. Archer. Hmm. What are you shooting at? Oh, it's you again, Poochie. Hey, aren't you? I knew it. You're that Master Bowman, the, the apple guy. What are you doing all the way out here in this nasty blizzard? Well, you see, I have come to realize something since setting off on my travels. It's my bow. It seems to bring about misfortune, so I decided to go far away where I couldn't cause any more trouble. And, what do you know, I ended up all the way out here, in the north. Anyway, Poochie, why not have a bite to eat and relax a bit? Thanks. Um. Oops. There's gotta be something with this sword thing. Lightning arrow! Ooh! Going on hot a sapling. Whoa, what the? Now my arrows bring on the thunder? This can't be. This can't be a coincidence. Doesn't seem like it. It doesn't seem like a curse either. This must be fate. This has to be a sign from the gods. It's my destiny to live and die with my arrows. You yeah, sure? All this time, I've been saying I wanted to do big things, but I was really just traveling so that I could have an easy life. Now, I see there's no such thing as an easy path. Not when you devote yourself to mastering one thing. The gods have shown me my true path, the path of archery. So, what are you going to do now? The time's come for me to stop being so whimsical. My real journey starts here and now. We must have some kind of strange link between us. It's only when you two are around that the gods show their hand. I'll never forget both of you. If we ever meet again, let's share a few apples and eat together. Farewell, my friends. He keeps dropping apples. The apple guy's gone. Boy, he's sure all fired up. 
even more so than usual. Maybe he's finally found his reason to live. If only all of us could have one of those. Oh, come on, camera. Now that I can use big brush strokes, I don't know what it's gonna do, but maybe it'll be uh, <coughs> maybe it'll be more useful. I doubt it, but it's cool that it can work like that. No more cursed zone. <coughs> <coughs> a lot of praise. I think we should level up. Uh, this one? Yeah. Hmm. More health. More ink. Can't do more ink. Well, let's get this health. Neat. Uh, there's no other people here. Okay, what's in here? Anything? Looks like there's bombs. Whoops. Examine? Where's the examine? There's an arrow smack dab in the middle of that target. Whoever did this must be a crack shot. Well, yeah, it was that guy who we just talked. We, we just talked to. Ugh, okay. Um. Alright, let's go this way. Speed. There we go. Cute little foxes. Uh, I just came from that way. I need to go this way. Hey, it's uh, it's Ume and uh, the the his kid. Huh? Is that you, doggy? Remember me? We played together back at Agatha Forest. Kokari? Is that you? How'd you get all the way out here? I wanted to become a real man like Susano. That's his name, Susano. I thought it was Susano. Um, so I took my dad's fishing pole and set out on an epic adventure. You know, I like the river, but it's nothing like the vast sea. It makes me realize just how insignificant my life was. Wow, you're no longer a crybaby when met in Agatha Forest. Now that I think about it, you look more grown up too. Hehe, <laughs> you really think so? Uh, I've seen a lot of Nippon's great outdoors, but the vast icy sea of Kamui is far harsher environment than anywhere else. If I could prove myself equal to the harsh wilderness here, maybe I could become a real man like Susano. Whoop, 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 whoop. Come on. There he is again, getting back to nature with his fishing pole, and without a line or bait to boot. Now I know why my dad cherished his pole. When I hold it in my hands, I, I hear the mountain of Mother Nature speak itself. Hey doggy, uh, how about we do some fishing like the old times? I want to show you what I can do now. Alright, sure, might as well fish. I haven't done it in a little while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah! Got a bite! I got a bite! Ooh, I almost forgot how to fish. Buffer fish! Oh! You caught me! Way to go! One more fish, blah 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 blah. Continue fishing, yes. I don't think there's really any necessariness to fish this, but we'll do it three times just in case there's an extra thing. Plus, we can sell the fish for money. Caught a seahorse. You're on a roll, champ. Don't give up now. 
Yes, continue fishing. We'll do it one more time like I always do. Got a bite! Okay, it doesn't look like there's gonna be, like, some big thing. I figured I'd try. Another seahorse. Got a seahorse. Nope. Alright. Yes, we're gonna quit already. There's no real point to this. Other than fishing. I got one! I got one! Getting back to nature sure is a lot of fun with you. A lot more fun with you, doggy. Alright. Ume doesn't have anything to say. Came from that way. Do, 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 do. What's in here? Oh, training dude. Look who's here. Greetings, my little wolf friend. What the? Not you again. Can you just pick a place to run on your JoJo and stick with it? I've already explained myself, no? Uh, be on a lone island among the waves or most frigid of mountain peaks. I forgot a warrior's path. I forged a warrior's path throughout the land. Wow, you're one serious dude, and here I thought you were laid back. Your face really changes when you get down to business. And what has brought you here? Do you wish to seek my tutelage in the fighting arts? Alright. Hard head. Break objects that you couldn't normally by tackling them. Okay. Might as well get this one. <coughs> I, I don't see a reason why we would need it unless... Um, unless there's actually a... Um, like, I have a feeling there's going to be an obstacle in our way. For some reason. Tips. Don't flinch, just press X. Yep. It's literally just... How I tackle before. Oh, do you understand? Okay. Technique scroll. Technique scroll. Ah, take that, I hate you. Alright, cool. I think we I think we got it. Not enough, eh? Listen, well, getting experience and single skill is admirable, but you never need to lose your drive and self-improvement. I pray that you will come back for more. Or something. Or something like that. Alright, so we got that one. Let's see if there's anything else that's useful. Um counter dodge. If you've mastered fleet books, damaging enemies with this new dodge. Eh. Maneuvers. Uh, Holy Eagle maneuvers will now damage enemies. What's Holy Eagle? Did I. Oh. Holy Falcon. Spirit Armageddon. You have mastered the Spirit Storm. Further your increase of rosary attack rate. Okay. Uh, add a third hit to your standard glaive attack. Yeah, I, I paid for so much stuff um, that I wasn't using because of... Oh, I forgot to switch my glaive from last time, too. Um, because I didn't realize that these techniques were... Um, like, specific to the weapon. So... Yep, X, 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 X. Yes, I understand. Tim scroll. What? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, that's really weird. You have to, like, do it in timing. What? 
It's literally just hitting X over and over again, but I can't. I'm hitting it too fast. That's stupid. One more time. Okay. Is that it, right? Pretty sure that's it. Had enough, eh? Game experience, blah blah blah. Uh, that is not. Uh, that is not what I'm trying to do. <laughs> All right. Do 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 do. Four shears, wailing mirror, equip reflectors as main and sub weapons to increase attack power. Equip mana and increase attack power. Sword dance. Equip glaives as mana sub to increase attack power. Press B to insult foes and get <laughs> demon fangs. That's interesting. Okay, so I use string beads. So we'll do this. And then we'll get the glaive thing too. Uh, oh, main and, is that what it said? I don't, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bead string god techniques. As both main and sub weapons, okay. So, yeah. Uh, I would need to... Interesting. I really much prefer the glaives, but I don't know, maybe... Maybe using these would be fun for a while? Yeah, yeah, yeah. God. This guy talks so much. Um, so there's also the glaive one. Increase attack power for having both glaives. Press B to insult foes. I don't think I have enough for all of those. Let's see. It's a hundred thousand. And that's two million. One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, it's two million. Um well let's take this. Cause I use glaives. I like glaives. I don't know if there's anything special about this glaive, but Yes, I understand. Yes, I understand. Ugh! Okay. Oh, I need a glaive equipped now. Bam! Oh wow, that's cool. One, two, three, four. Oh wait. Oh, that is really cool. That is really cool. I don't, I don't, I don't want to put more energy into it. Just let me leave. Let me leave. Kind of wish it had a health bar so I could see how much damage I was actually doing to these dummies. 
and compare with other weapons and stuff. But we might as well get the uh, the sword thing. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Holy crap. Shouldn't have to go through all of this when I'm doing this. Uh, both main and sub weapons for this technique, yes. Okay. Understand. Wap. And equip. Oh, that one also gri- Oh. Hold and release for charged attack with Orochi Glaive. Uh, grants ink bullets. Neat. Yay! Oh, neat. Oh, I see. Okay, see, I can, wheel, I can double wield glaives. <laughs> that's cool. All right, that's good enough. Yes, I've had enough. Holy crap. Well, we learned some new things. So, that's good. Um... Maybe if I have enough, I'll get the... Yeah, fine. We'll insult them for demon fangs. I know they're useful at, s at some trader, but I don't know. I don't remember what the trader used them for. Yep. Yes, I understand. Insult the demon. <laughs> oh my god! That's so funny! <laughs> oh, and then I have to, uh... Probably kill it. That's cool. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. That's that's way too funny. Yay. Yeah, go away. I'm gonna just learn all of them so I don't have to come back here ever again. Talk to him ever again. Alright, we're good. <sighs> now that we've trained. Is there anything out here? Can't even see. Can't see. Nothing there. Nothing there. Okay, so we got Ume. We got that. We went and trained. We fed these foxes. Um, I think we came from there. We need to find the village. Okay. What? Man, these things are weird. Come at me. Okay, something's off here. Why can't I do damage to this? Um... Wow. 
Why can't I do damage to this guy? Oh, uh, fire. Yes. Okay. The fire on the tail. Got it. So I need to, I need to break the tail. Or something. Come on. Why can't I break the tail? Oh. Okay. Fire. Melt the thing. And hiya. Okay, cool. Impenetrable snow. All right. Um, going this way, right? Yeah, going this way. Oh, this must be a. Yep. I had a feeling like I wouldn't get much blizzard bleh, business in this blizzard. And it looks like I'm right. I suppose an animal like you wouldn't understand, but it's tough trading snow. Uh, trading in the snow, looking for monsters. Uh, thing is, I just can't leave. Some people need me. Can you imagine how hard that is? If you have any sympathy, you'll buy something. Yeah, I'll do some shopping. I need to sell stuff to you. And sell some fish. And buy... Let's see. Um, I could use some mermaid coins. Exorcism. I'll buy a couple of these. A couple of large bones. Actually, you know what? The medium ones fill my bar. So we'll just do that. There. I have helped out local businesses. Oh, there's a. Alright. Take care of this. Oh, right. Watcha! Watcha! Is that everything? Oh, wow. That was really quick. Oh, there was a drum dude. Where are you? Ow. Come on. Uh, I'm so not used to having that shotgun that I had before. That's cool. I really like these glaives. I thought I liked the uh, the beads as the secondary, but I like the glaives more, I think. Ooh, mermaid pool. Cool. Um, which way did I come from? That way. So I need to go this way. Is there anything in here? Hey, what's up? Ah, nothing feels good like a like a fire. There we go. Wally. Oh, what have I done? If it scares on, Kamui will be ruined. I have to do something to stop it. But I'm no match for those assassin monsters. Oh, what am I gonna do? 
Hello, Wolfie. What are you doing out here in the blizzard? I envy you. You must have such an easy, carefree life. What I wouldn't give to be like you. I'm doomed to spend my days here, living in fear of those monsters. What's eating you, man? You might feel better if you just talk about it. Oh, you have a punkle with you. A white wolf and a punkle? That's like the old legend. This must be the uh, will of the gods. Uh, they must have told you to come here and help me. Nah, you got it all wrong, young man. I'm not. I find that whole young man thing so a little patronizing. I've got a proper name, you know. I am called Wally. Distressed Youngster Wally. Doesn't look young. Listen to my tale, messenger of the gods. It all started over a year ago. I was living in a, in Webkir, uh, the village up in the mountains. It's the home of the Kutone, the divine sword that protects Kamui. Because the village elder always treated it with so, so much respect, I couldn't help but feeling curious, so one day I touched it. You know, I only touched it a tiny, tiny little bit, honest. Ever since, it seems to be cursed with bad luck. My sandals broke. I rejected. I was rejected by the girl I liked. I banged my toe countless times on an icicle fell on my head. And on top of all that, this awful blizzard came along. Now those assassin monsters are out here in the wild trying to kill me. I didn't want to cause any more trouble, so I came here. Wow! I can't believe you survived all this, th all this long, ugh, this long, all by yourself. So what do those assassin monsters do to you? Well, it's very strange. You see, the. They're always yelling at me from far off in the distance. I know they're what they're up to. They're trying to break me emotionally. Then they'll come in for the kill. You have to help me, Wolfie. Uh, you have to get rid of them. See, here's a list of their names. Okay. I forgot all about this wanted list thing. Boy, you sure are thorough, man. Like, we had a wanted list, like, in the first couple of seasons, or the first couple of episodes, but uh, I just never really did anything with it. I think the gods place something, some kind of mark on the assassin monsters. You'll definitely know when you come across one. They're very wary, though. They only come out at night. Please get rid of them so that I can sleep peacefully again. <sighs> Alright, well, we'll give it a shot, I guess. And by that I mean we'll, we'll kill them if we come across them and not actually go and hunt them out. Oh look, a ram. You like herbs, right? Yeah. Sweet. Oh, there's another one. Alright. Hua, hua, hua. Sword play. There's gotta be another one. Yep. Oh, there's one of these things. Oh, I was hoping I could get another big head in. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. That's cool. You get so many different like attacks with that uh, the orange glaive and the. Uh... All right. Uh, let's see. 
Oh, maybe this is what they meant by Iron Head. No. No. Maybe I can blow it up. No. No. Maybe I can slash it. Nope. Alrighty then. Alright, so there's an up. And... Ooh, bears. Hello, bears. Oh, bears like fish. That is a weird looking bear. What is this? Uh, needs fire? Nope. Needs bomb? This is the mark of the protection of the, the Oinia tribe in Kamui. Let's forget about this place. We got better things to do. Alright, fine. Just being curious. Here you are yelling at me and telling me stuff. Is that a cave over there? A cave over there. Feed? Feed what? Feed fish? What am I actually feeding? What am I feeding? Oh, rabbits. When did the rabbits... Where were the rabbits? Maybe they were under the bridge. Yep, they were under the bridge. Let's see what's in this cave over here. Bats! They're cute. Um. That is not what I wanted. Bear. Um, looks like I need flame. Alright. Well, I have flame now. It didn't look like there was flame there before. Nighttime? Nighttime. Come on. There we go. Cool. Useless stray bead. Whoa! Tribe of the Moon. Scroll drawn by watering artists for any useful information. Log book. This thing? As you well know, Kamui is a harsh land covered in snow, and the monsters that infest the region only make life worse. Okay, I already, uh, already looked at that. Um, travel guide? There we go. After de decades of international debate, I have decided... Uh, internal debate. I have decided to write about the man who spoke to me regarding the Celestial Plains destruction. I shall endeavor to shoulder the heavy burden that is of that man's fate. My brush shall act as a bridge to shadowy past. The man, the man had identified himself as a member of the Moon Tribe. The idea of life thriving on that desolate rock is mind-boggling. Furthermore, their civilization has far surpassed our own. Most of their ranks succumbed to death, but this man had fled. He was silent on the topic of why civilization was destroyed, what business could the golden tribe of the moon have with us? I gaze into the distance, knowing the answer no could not evade me forever. 
Interesting. All right. Ow. All right, cool. Big exorcism slip. Slip. What do we got over here? Ooh, what's this? How do I... There must be something that I can get that will uh, let me break these things. Unless I can burn it. No? Alright. Well, this was useless for now. Aww. <sighs> what? Oh, come on! There. I know I can go one, two, three. Okay. And there's one more that I missed. Tanned a vengeance slip. Alright, so that was in the cave. Now we go up here. Webkir! Whoa! It's like the whole village has been frozen solid. I wonder if anyone's still alive. Possibly... Hmm... Snowball... Snowball... wonder if there's a reason for this snowball. Looks like I need fire over here somewhere. Let's save real quick. Go we'll take a look around. Ooh, icy. Merchant? <gasps> the merchant's gone. What does it say? Hey, Amy, come on, we got better things to do. Then what? Look at things. No good. This door won't budge. Okay. So everything is frozen. What was that? Daytime? What is this? Whoa. I know I have better things to do. I still want to know what these signs say. Look at those warriors. Maybe in here? No good, door won't budge. Oh, the sheep are living, so that's a good thing. That is not what I wanted. That is also not what I wanted. Nope, I guess you can't cut those. Hmm, maybe I can go in here? No good, won't budge. Nope. Alright. Keep going up then. Oh, somebody's angry. I can't get in my door! Halt! Who goes there? This is the house of the village el elder. If you need something from the elder, you must go through me. I'm Semikel. Top warrior of the Oinya, Oinya tribe. Oinya warrior Samikul. Sheesh, who does this guy think he is? Well, at least we gotta make... Well, at least we finally meet somebody from the village. So, what are you doing standing around here in the middle of the blizzard? Hmm? That grating voice, is that you as soon? What in the world are you doing with that strange white wolf? That's none of your business, pal. 
Anyway, what's with the village? It's a total mess. Is it true that the demons have taken over as a Fuji? You must have been gone for some time if you don't know that. Save your questions for when you get back to your own village. That is, of course, if it hasn't already been buried in snow. Oh, take this suspicious wolf with you too. Why, you little, we're done talking to you. Just let us into the chief's house now. No, you may not pass. We normally not even let strangers into the village, and I've, I've told the villagers not to let anyone into their houses. They will obey me, for I am Smeekle, chief of the w chief of Webkey here. <laughs> now be on your way. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to fight, so let's just go over here real quick. See if I can go through this door. I bet the gates shut tight to keep demons out. Okay, well that's where we're gonna have to go eventually. Hold on a sec. You, Chief, what happened to the old man Kemu? Kemu? He didn't buy the farm, did he? Fool, of course he's still alive. But he's been greatly weakened battling the demons. Now they're. Hi hideous monsters are trying to finish him off, since only the Elder's volcanic in incantation can foil their plans. That is why I became chief of the village. I must protect the Elder from the monsters lurking in every corner. Now, be on your way. Uh. Let us by, Smackle! <laughs> you want us to make you? I sense extra, extraordinary power in this white wolf, but if you don't heed my warning, I'll devour you where you stand. Now be on your way. Still as stubborn as a mule, I see. Come on, Amy, we had it with this village. No. Uh, it looks like I'm not going to be able to actually fight him. Okay, well. So I can't go that way. I can't go that way. Um, there's nothing over here. Um, I'm pretty sure I, c I still can't go in these doors. Alright. No good. If it would only let me look at the signs so I could tell what was going on. No good. Won't budge. Not sure exactly what I'm supposed to be doing now. Why? There we go. Is there anything on the other side of that? I don't see anything. What about the map? Where am I? Okay, well, I can't go that way. Maybe there's something on the dock? Oh. Excuse me, bear. Stray bead. Oh. I didn't realize, but I got a ton more things. Uh, I guess I can't level anything up yet, though. That's fine. Where are we going? Uh, it looks like there's a dock this way. Maybe the dock will do something? Or maybe there's something at the dock? Man, this thing really has a problem with, like, drawing stuff. Okay. Doesn't look to be anything special. Hmm. Alright, 
So nothing in this village will actually do anything for me. All right. Well, we're gonna call it here for today. Thank you for watching. Um, come back next week for more Okami. Um, I will try to figure out where I'm exactly supposed to be going for next week. Uh, if I cannot be here, um, none of these signs do anything for me, and I guess I have to leave again. So who knows? Um, I'll figure it out. Thanks for watching, um, and we'll see you next week.